who's a marketing producer for Garage Games. Um, can you um, just give us a little detail about um, what your company does and what they provide people? Our company does a pretty uh, broad range of stuff, uh, publishing, developing, and also middleware. So we kind of try to cover the full spectrum of the game industry. We provide the tools for people to make games, and we also provide a place for them to take those games when they need a publishing opportunity. And why should um, people come to you guys? Like, What is like the unique factor that makes you stand out from your competitors? Well, our game engines are really accessible, and especially to indie developers. Our indie, we have an indie and commercial licensing scheme, and our engines start at $100. So it's really accessible for people who are just getting into the industry, don't necessarily have a lot of money, but want to try to make games. Uh, we also have a large community, so if people want to uh, find other, if it's a programmer needs an artist or a writer or somebody to do audio, they can come onto our site, go to the forums, go to the job listings, and uh, find the people they need for their project. Okay, awesome. What are some um, past projects that you guys have helped um, to create? Well, our engine is based off uh, Tribes and Tribes 2, the founders of the company who worked on that game extensively. Uh, we've used it to make in-house games like Think Tanks, Zap, Marble Blast Gold, Marble Blast Ultra, which is on the Xbox Live Arcade. Um, a, a bunch of independent games have come out onto our site and other sites, um, other portals around the web. Chrono Games has also made a game for the Wii that's coming out in the fall uh, called uh, The Mask of Zorro, so they got a good IP for that using our engine.